Welcome to our Christmas house tour. This is our mat that doesn't fit and has been weed on by dogs. This is our Christmas wreath, which you might remember from last year because it's the same one. So let's close the door. So this is our tree. It's a tiny bit crooked, but we'll just forget about that because it's a real tree and it smells amazing, but it's also beside a radiator. So that's why it's kind of slowly gone like this over time. You can probably recognize some decorations from last year. Some of them are the same, some are different. We've got a little more teas over here and we've got an ice cream truck as well. They're new. There's also a few other bits that are new. And then we temporarily have the presents under the tree, but this typically doesn't happen because the dogs will wee on them. Then over here, you probably remember this from last year and possibly the year before. I've got this little thing which goes across. I think you're supposed to put like little things into the stockings, but I never do. I just have it for decoration. These two guys were from my mum. She got them for me when we were still living in Ireland. This ball here was a new, I, th I think that was a Christmas present last year. And I think that's from Nora Ashley. This was made by Eduardo at an art class. You've probably seen them in the vlogs, but I don't think I've officially ever shown them. These are our anniversary pictures. It's not a Christmassy thing, this is something we have up year round. But we've got our wedding picture, year one, year two, year three, year four, and year five. We've also got our Santa Stop Here sign, which I really like this. I think this is from home base or B&Q, I'm not sure. Either one of the two. This healthy thing is from John Lewis and it stays there all the time. This candle is a Christmas candle, which smells like Christmas, smells like the Christmas tree. This wreath I got at the same time as the one that's on our door, but the only difference is it doesn't have sparkles on it. <laughs> Jonathan just walked into the Christmas tree. And this is our nativity set, this is new. So Jonathan bought this as a prop for a video, but then the video <laughs> didn't get made, so we just decided to keep it, because it's really cute. And the kids love playing with it and messing around with all the pieces, and thankfully, thank the baby Jesus, none of them have gone missing, although the baby Jesus has gone missing quite a few times, but we've always managed to find him. I'm gonna bring you into the living room, slash family room, slash playroom, slash dog room, <laughs> slash everything. So it, normally, if you watch the vlogs, you know that it doesn't look like this. This is like very uncommon for it to look this tidy. I wish it looked like this all the time, but it doesn't. So over here, just don't mind the candle wax stains on the wall. This is a reindeer, which I thought I had two of, but I can only find one this year for some reason. <laughs> These lights, I think I got them at, I want to say I got them at home base. I could be wrong. We got this tree which comes with like a million different pieces and this actually is musical my mum got this for the kids i'm not sure where she got this these are our elves which this morning i mean they're always doing something different but this morning they were having a picnic that's why they're dressed up fancy because they were on a date that's their reindeer and then this is our couch i mean it's like a winter time couch so basically all I did was swap out the throws for like wintry ones. I love this one that I'm sitting on. This one's from Zara Home and it is so soft. The dogs aren't allowed in here during the day anymore or we try not to let them, but they are allowed in here at night. And when they do come in, they love it because it's so cozy. And then we've got our winter cushions. So we don't normally have the furry ones out. I have no idea where that's from, probably home base or b and and then these ones, thank you, I think, <laughs> I don't remember, somewhere, I bought them last year. So these are our furry cushions and then the rest of them are this one, these plain ones are always out like year round. Then we've got some Christmassy candles, so this gingerbread man one is from Homefront in Ireland. I bought one from my mum as well, so she has a matching one. This one, oh, I don't even remember where this is from, but it's really old. I've had this probably the longest, this little lantern. 
This was a present. It's from Bath and Body Works. The cinnamon caramel literally smells like that in here. Like a lot, because I was bringing it last night, including my hair. <laughs> smells of it too. Over here we've got two trees and they're just glass. Uh, really impractical to have in a playroom, but you know, that's just how we roll. Jonathan just tripped over a car. Um, I left out one thing. This thing was also from B&Q and this was like two years ago I think I got this, so I just hang it up there. That is our Christmas house tour. Hopefully next year, fingers crossed, we'll be in our new house and I will have lots more to show you. So I'm going to show you out now because it's time to go. Bye-bye. I'll see you again next year. Bye.